have to run how to see how to authenticate them together. This authentication two tools. And I, I think in the world is a very popular, Airflow is a very popular all over the world. Uh, but now we we had another uh, orchestration tools called uh, Dolphin Scheduler. I think it's a very it's, it's easy for uh, for non uh, uh, engineering based uh, uh, users to use to use uh, big data orchestrations because it's drag and drop to create some workflows. And uh, Flight is uh, very popular in AI and machine learning uh, work, uh, workflow orchestration tools. And the DAX3 and the Perfect is uh, SaaS, uh, very popular in America. And also, uh, there's many, many uh, BI and uh, analysis tools. It's open source. Then you can uh, use them to uh, analyze your big data, like such as a superset, a e chart, and uh, we and the query book, or Redash, or Metabase, or Latdash. Is, is, this is a very popular uh, open source projects in all over the world. And also, uh, I know that ChatGPT is very hot these days. And actually, uh, ChatGPT is, uh, is, is the, the model to train in ChatGPT is based on, uh, on Ray. It's, it's also uh, uh, open source projects. And also, we have a uh, PyTorch and uh, Jupyter and uh, TensorFlow and MyStore my and, and Paddle Paddle. And, uh, OpenMLDB. These are some open source uh, 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 AI uh, pro uh, projects. So you can see there's many, many open source modern uh, data stack tools, and you can choose one if you want. And uh, uh, today I want to uh, introduce you some uh, uh, some some basic idea of how to use uh, these kind of uh, uh, modern data stack tools to build your own uh, uh, data analysis. Now we have a, we call the ETLT architecture. You know, uh, we have, you, perhaps you have many, many data, but you, your data is uh, stored, for example, in the SaaS or in your spreadsheet or in your cloud database. You then the, so you have to ex extract the data from different data sources. And then you will do a, a we call a, a transform that we can uh, let this kind of data to load into your data warehouse. And this process we call the ETL and uh, extract, extract the load, uh, transform and the load. And then when you, you ETL the uh, data source into your uh, data, uh, data warehouse, you can do a lot of uh, business transformation in your data warehouse, uh, in your Snowflake or in your TrainerDB or in your Hadoop. Then uh, perhaps some uh, business analyst or uh, data application developer, or or you, if you can write a SQL, even a product manager can write a SQL in, in Snowflake or TrainerDB to do your uh, data analysis. And also, some data scientists can use the AI tools to do this, uh, to, to do more advanced uh, analysis uh, algorithms. And uh, for uh, for uh, uh, for a, a small company, you can use uh, this uh, big data architect to build a very easily used uh, big data uh, application. Uh, you know, uh, now in, in in nowadays we have a two different type of data. One, we call it uh, real-time data. And uh, the other, we call it batch batch data. And uh, real-time data, that means you have to collect the data real-time. And you have to uh, compute the data real-time. And you have to analyze the data real-time. Now we have uh, CTANO. It's, uh, it's uh, Apache Open Source Projects, and, it, and, and it's free. And you can collect the data no matter in your IoT devices or your database or in your spreadsheet or your in your log or in your uh, SAP or ERP or SAM uh, software, you can collect the data real time and then you can load them into the Kafka. Uh, Kafka is uh, uh, we call a uh, 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 it's a middleware <laughs> that that can 
store the, the message uh, in real time, or you can just uh, load the data into your uh, real time data warehouse. For example, you can uh, read, uh, load the data into the ClickHouse or into the uh, AWS uh, Redshift, or you can load the data to, 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 uh, to other real time uh, data warehouse. And also you can send it into your uh, alert system. That uh, means you, you can send it to the API. You can alert some uh, IoT devices is wrong or not. You can, you can monitor the, the whole, uh, uh, the, the whole uh, real-time data. And uh, uh, the other way, we call the batch time data. And uh, you can also use the Citano to load the data from your spreadsheet or from your Google Doc or from your, uh, uh, from your uh, uh, Salesforce or some, some other SaaS. Or you, you also you can extract the data from uh, from Oracle, from MySQL or SQL Server or some database, and and it's uh, very easy to use. That uh, that means you you need to be an engineer or a programmer. Uh, you can just uh, use a very very easy script to do the, this kind of things, and then you can load the data into your uh, data warehouse or your data lake or your OLAP engine. And uh, also, if you want to do some uh, 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 data analysis to write some SQL to, to handle the, the whole uh, orchestration, uh, the whole workflow orchestration, you can use the, the Apache Dolphin scheduler. Uh, and you can just uh, drag and drop to create the, the uh, ETL jobs or your, your Hadoop jobs or your, uh, your Flink jobs. And also, you can manage, we call it uh, ML ops, machine learning ops. And you can manage your uh, AI training process uh, by Dolphin Scheduler. So, so it's uh, it's uh, something like uh, traffic light in in big data platform. And uh, then and then you can also use the Citano to to load the data from your data warehouse back to your uh, SaaS or back to your database. So it's uh, uh, simply a uh, 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 big data architecture for small or medium uh, uh, enterprise. And then I want to introduce uh, two of the projects. One is we call it Apache uh, Citano, and it's uh, in Apache uh, Incubator. And uh, uh, because we have um, so many, many uh, data sources, so that's why we have to use Apache Citano. There's so many data sources, uh, Google Doc and, and, and other database. And uh, sometimes you have to use the, we call real time and a batch, batch data together. And uh, uh, you have to use to, 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 to monitor the whole, uh, whole, uh, the, the whole uh, extract the data process. So Citano is uh, very easy to use uh, projects that you can 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 extract the data from uh, different data sources, and uh, then you can load them into a different data target, and the the performance is very good, and uh, now it has more than one hundred, uh, uh, more than one hundred connectors to to help you to synchronize the data to anywhere. So you can see there's uh, many many uh, like uh, cloud connectors or database connectors. Or SaaS connectors, and uh, and uh, it is free <laughs> because it's open source projects, and uh, so I think it's very very useful uh, uh, open source project to integrate your data from different database or from different cloud or from different SaaS into your uh, database or snow or 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 to your uh, data warehouse, and also I think it's. Uh, uh, some 